Okay, we are here again. To do this, we are going to click on green. Then we are going to click on reflect a little bit here. And we are going to put this texture to this teapot. In this one, we are going to collect a kind of ambient ray material. Select diffuse. We can click a gold color. Then a reflect click like this. And we are going to put it in this tube. Okay, if we click on render, we can see the results. The results are being very good. Now we have to put a light. To do this, we will go to V-Ray lights, select V-Ray, V-Ray sun, and we're going to put a sun like this. Click on yes, and then we have to move the sun a little bit up. The target is OK. And in the intensity, we'll change the parameter to 0.1. Now if we click on render, we can see the reflections, but it's a lot of intensity, so we can click 0 0.03. Now if we click on render, we can see a better result. But as you can see, there is a lot of dark here, so we have to do a change. To do this, we go to render setup, we go to indirect illumination, and we click on. So if we click again on render, we can see that it is maybe making many pre-pass, but we will have a better result. As you can see, now we have a better result. Okay, now what we are going to do is to put an opni light here. We go to photometric, we go to standard, select opni. We are going to put an opni here. And we're going to move it a little bit up just to illuminate our scene. We can go to the intensity and color of this. Be sure that the shadows are not on. And the player you can put 0.4 or 0 0.5. 0 0.5 is okay. And the real light is a little bit yellow, so we can click like this. If we click on render again, we can see that it's a little bit more with lights. I like it, I really like it. So, our image is almost finished. We're going to change the color of this green teapot. In diffuse, select this. Reflect is OK. And in fog color, let's put more green. Refract, leave it in this one, and as we can see, we will have another result. But first, we are going to put a little bit like this. So, if we click on render, we can see a result. So as you can see, it's better. I don't like this tip, but we will erase it. Mm. 
delete and press 8 on your keyboard to put another background go to bitmap and if you have a, bra a, bra a background select yours if you don't have one you can search it in google I, ha I think I have one here yes this and now as you can see we have this thing here so we're going to move the camera a little bit up like this and now we're going to click on render as you can see our teapot isn't there anymore we will have the sky in the window and that's how we made a bit ray reflection making the texture of chrome thank you for watching my tutorial i hope you enjoy it and i hope you learn to have a nice day and thank you for watching.